this is a Ruminato. What? We're back here. European War 5 got our Industrial Age conquest going on with Russia. Round 31. We had just built our badass army of generals. Well, actually, I don't know how badass it is yet until we try to take something. But we were ready to take London with him, so we're about to find out really quick how badass they actually are. Got my generals healed up. Now we can start kicking Germany's ass. They started wrecking France, and as much as I don't like France, you know, I don't want Germany to get too big either. So they need to be dealt with. I've got to keep every country down. I can't let anyone get too big. I can't let it get too big. Boom! That's what she said. Hold on, would she have said that? I can't let it get too big. Yeah, I guess she could have said that. It, it could make sense that she would say that. Got our treaty going on with Japan. At least until we take out China. And maybe even after that, because by the time I take out China, I'm going to have to reposition all my troops, probably. So we might be allies with Japan for a while. Uh, you know, I'm sorry I have to do this to you, Germany, but... You're in the way of progress, bro, and this is what happens when countries stand in the way of progress. Alright. Here's the real test. They all pretty much have full health except the one guy. Let's see how this goes. Let's see how much damage we're going to be able to do with these guys. I would hope for them to live so I could send them into the US. Oh, damn! I mean, I don't know, is that bad? It was a major city, okay, so it had good defenses. It had five units there, but those are all generals. I don't know. I think I used up, there she is. I'm gonna reheal them and then send them to the US. I don't know, they, they took a little bit more damage than I think they should have. Not, not too bad. I mean, it wasn't just like rage quit type of damage, but I don't know. Oh, we already got China. What am I talking about? Bro, where you been? Have you been playing this game? Of course I have. I don't know. Like, what was I doing? What was I doing when China went out? That must have happened last game. Either that or I definitely wasn't paying attention at the first part of this game because I don't remember that happening. I thought we were still working on I thought that was the whole reason I was allied with Japan. Sometimes, bros, just... You lose touch with reality. And we're talking like the real reality, like game reality. Ah, uh, where do I want to go? Um, I don't want to leave Amsterdam up there. I don't know. Go ahead and piece them off again. I got things going on in Europe that I gotta pay for. I got big, big things going on. Alright, 
Damn, they're healing quick. They must not have much health. Either that or that healer's just really badass. Well, it's kind of like I said. I talked about this before. When you put down the 15% um, heal princess, it seems like it like heals the shit out of them like 75%. Let's um, go ahead and get some more gash flow. As long as Japan and the US are going at each other, that's good for me. That helps me out. Damn, they are almost completely healed up. What is going on? I'm telling ya, that princess heals way more than 15%. Oh, what? Why you wanna come at me? What did I do? And not only that, but you guys wrecked me. Damn. You didn't even lose a troop. I don't agree with that. They should have at least lost a troop. I had really good defense. I mean, health-wise. It wasn't... They just broke through like it wasn't shit. They broke through like... the, Like... Like I was the French. How much damage did you take that time, I wonder? Never enough money. I mean, I'm not asking to do a shitload, but I never have enough money to do anything. Why is everything gotta be so expensive? Already, bros, it's just the industrial age and inflation is taken off. I remember when the cost of a, of a rifleman was... A hundred silver. Now it costs 550 silver. Alright, switch places. Do I want to go at the US already? I don't think so. I'll at least hold off for now. Well, let's get in some action here. Let's um, let's attack the Japanese, and then like complete and utter cowards. After we're done here, make peace with them. Just like, what's up, little bitches? You got your ass kicked. Oh, uh, let's make peace. Actually, I don't... You know what? Let's... We might risk it and just let it slide for a round, right? What are they going to do to us? Nothing. Except for that. But you made the mistake attacking my generals. You could have attacked any of the other places. You attacked the wrong damn spot. Damn! Germany's not playing around with France. I wouldn't either, bros. Um, what do I want to do here? Can't really attack from Dublin yet because my flank is wide open. I gotta... Get some troops moved around here first. I 
Boom, took Paris from you little bitches. Before you know it, we will be linked up around the globe. Actually, it's not going to be before you know it because it's going to take a while. It's going to take a while to put Japan and the U.S. out. And that's where we're going to link up, somewhere in the North America. Which is not going to happen quickly. Alright, that I feel better now about my Japanese front. I was, I was pretty concerned with it. I think we're good now. We got sixes on all spots connected to Japan. And now we can't attack and lose all of them. Sound like a good idea? Perfect. Well, I lost, but I uh, did a shit ton of damage to all of them. Oh, they just took a 15% loss to all buildings. That'll be helpful. Really? Germany, I thought we were cool. I was, I, I was helping you out. Like, I thought you had too much land to control, so I was going to come in and help you control it. Man, I've been playing. Okay. Before I was trying to figure out Hearts of Iron 4, now I've just been playing a shitload of it. I'm getting better, but I find the game difficult. I can beat, you know, crap countries like, you know, Poland or, or France, but um, it's hard... Once the whole war gets going and you have all those allies against you, it's hard to keep them, keep them off, especially when your allies suck. Like, sometimes I've noticed Italy will be, like, badass. They could, like, almost single-handedly take out France by themselves. And then you'll play again and it'll just be like, what happened to you guys? You got, like, 20 divisions and, and, and you're being invaded from every direction and now I gotta come down and help you. And I'm already fighting the Russians, and I already got, you know, the UK and the US trying to land. I did figure out, you know, I, I do feel like I have a good grasp of the sea warfare. I got a good grasp of the air warfare. I just need to understand ground war better. Then I'll be able to start making videos. I don't know how I'll do that, because <laughs> I can see that game taking a long-ass time to win. At least when you're starting out. I'm sure as you play it and get to, get, get to know the nuances of it, you can start just crashing through. Kind of like this game, even though it's way more simple. It still took a long-ass time when I first started playing it to win. I mean, what? Remember my like first conquest was a hundred and what was it like seventeen turns? And now I do it in I don't know I guess it depends on what age I'm playing. But it damn sure doesn't take me a, over a hundred turns. I mean even this, with my generals down ten levels, it's not gonna take me a hundred turns. It, it'll probably end up being I don't know, 70? Somewhere in the 70s, probably? But yeah, I love Hearts of Iron 4. It's just... Getting used to it. Don't. 
What? Holy shit. No fucking way. The U.S. just took Japan out. What? That had never happened for me. I could have attacked Tokyo. And they'd have moved the capital. I could attack the next place they moved it. And they'd have moved it again. The U.S. attacks at once and they take them over? What kind of bullshit is that? Now we got a problem. The U.S. has got too big. Hmm, we're definitely gonna have to focus on the U.S. They're, they're just... They're gonna be raking in too much resources. How did that even happen? I don't even believe- I don't believe that happened. The only good thing about it is look at all the stuff on the front with me. There's like no troops on it. There's absolutely... Damn, the U.S. is going crazy. What is going on with you bros? Why so violent? Too many first-person shooter video games. And Hollywood gun culture. That's what it is, bros. Totally blame that. I blame video games and uh, violent culture in Hollywood for violence in the U.S. about as much as I think safe spaces are a good idea. Um, we should be able to take a lot of shit over before they can move in troops. Let's do like a all-out offensive. See how much shit we can take over before they start reinforcing everything. I mean, them taking Japan might turn out to be good for us. I mean, thanks to them doing that, I already got three more cities. Easily taken, too. Make that four. With very little damage taken. I'm still fighting the Chinese in my head. The Chinese are still in the game, bros. They're, they're somewhere. They're Lin B and his little couple units of troops. They're hiding out somewhere. Anyways, bros, I think round 43 is a good place to wrap this up. We'll start out at round 44 next time. If you're enjoying this content, you know what to do. Stop this shit out of like and subscribe, and we'll see you back here for our next upload. Peace. Bruminati out.